Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to some Call of Duty 4 Domination on Countdown. We're going to be using El Chapinero, which is the M60 Golden with a red dot. And I would call this creative class combination El Chapinero in a good old Call of Duty 4 days because this gun just fucking rapes. It's like two shot kills, you get 100 bullets in your clip. I mean, it does reload pretty slow, but it's a great gun. And personally, it's my favorite LMG on Call of Duty 4. I mean, the saw is pretty respectable with its fire rate and its accuracy. And the RPD does work too, but that's one thing I didn't really like about World at War or Modern Warfare 2, that they really didn't implicate the LMGs too much. Don't get me wrong, there's only three in this game, but... They can go toe to toe with a assault rifle for the most part. I mean, you gotta have faster reloads on assault rifle. I mean, they both got their ups and downs, but I mean, the AUG bar, you could say, in Modern Warfare 2, maybe a RPD on Skid Row, but other than that, in Modern Warfare 2, it's not really, it's unfair if you use, I mean, it's an unfair fight if you use an LMG versus a UMP or AK or any gun, really, the ACR. But, I mean, the AUG bar is pretty respectable, I'm not going to lie. But I hope Black Ops implicates more LMG gameplay. In World at War, there was a DP, which looked fucking crazy, but it was pretty respectable. The Browning was good. I think it's the MG42, that little German gun. That was a pretty decent gun, but... I don't know, I like, I like the LMGs. I like the fact that you can spray for like half a minute, and you got to... Be careful with your ammo, because after you d you're done spraying, you're going to need a half a minute to reload or something. It's crazy. It's like 15 seconds, which in our gaming lives, it feels like forever. Like, reload and you're in their spawn. You're taking your time. Flipping switch. Oh, I missed something. Let me go back and readjust it. <laughs> I don't know. About that. I like LMGs. I, I, see, I don't see too much LMG gameplay on YouTube anymore. And the thing with... The World at War in Modern Warfare 2, LMGs, it feels like it doesn't got an, enough bullets in the clip. I mean, personally, I could shoot this for half a minute. I mean, the RPD got a lot, but I don't know. The, the saw, I mean, not the saw, what is it? The M240 on Call of Duty 4? That shit's weak. That's It's like a saw, but it's like half as strong. And I don't know. I just I just like seeing the LMG. Look at that guy. He ain't Grizz, baby. He just got embarrassed. That, that was his gamer take. I don't want to like go oh, I'm talking shit. No, that's his gamer take. Anyways, what? I went two, three minutes talking about LMGs. Let's talk about LMG. This game, I was going to talk about something else this gameplay, but let's just talk about LMG. What, what's your favorite LMG of all time? I mean, the DP28, the thing, I, it had 47 bullets in the clip, but you could shoot fucking forever, and it was pretty powerful. The DP28 was pretty nice, and... But the El Chapadero was golden and it just looked so sexy with the gold. Look at that. That's like 10 pounds of gold. You can you can pawn that for like 10,000 bucks. Wait, that's not the price of gold, but... What is the price of gold? Do you guys want to cash for gold? Do you guys ever do that? I was interested in it. Like, I, I, I sent in, I got the little free mailing kit. Like, I, I don't know, I got some little chain that I found somewhere I wanted to see how much I would get for it like I don't give a fuck about it I'm never gonna wear it never cash for gold the, the thing I want to talk about with gold and Call of Duty 4 is like they gave it to the most random guns like the Dragonoff no one wants to have a golden Dragonoff I mean it, anything looks good in gold but put it on the Barrett it would have been nice on the Barrett or at least the M40 and then the LMG, I respect their decision. They couldn't have made the saw, the saw golden. Look at me playing the objective like an MLG pro. But the RPD wouldn't look right. The mini Uzi, I guess. You can do it on the mini Uzi. It would look nice on the 74U. I mean, the AK, okay, I can understand that. But the shotgun, the M1014, it could have been golden. I guess the, it, it looks nice gold, but I would rather have the other one. Like, I wish you could pick what gun you had golden. I mean, it's not, it probably won't be too hard to do that, but I hear Black Ops is going to do something like that. I'm not sure. I, I just heard from a bird that 
something about 15th prestige, you gotta have golden guns, and that'd be fun. So I, I like the golden guns, it switches it up, makes it look a, nice, a lot sexier. And that's really all I gotta say about that. Well, I got a few other gameplays that I got today, and I wanna... I'm gonna commentate over those on talking what I wanted to talk about in this video because you see my host bugs out right here and that's what I wanted to talk about but I got distracted by the LMG talk so I'll post a video response to this video if you want to go check out me talking about my newfound hosting ability so thank you for watching if you enjoyed the video or commentary leave a thumbs up I love it when you like it and I will see you guys later thanks for watching bye